Hi everyone, my name's Adam and today we're going to build this planter box. Now just a quick couple of things, the footage you're about to see is taken from a live stream that I did building the planter box. So the angle is pretty much just going to be the same thing the whole time. I did move the camera towards the end, but it doesn't really matter that much. Now I'm going to, throughout the live stream, I did talk and explain what I was about to do. So I'll probably keep a few of those in just to show you what I'm going to do. And then time lapse or speed up the footage of me actually doing it. Now I do wish to apologize. I'm pretty sure the audio is not going to be the best when I'm talking because I didn't have a microphone plugged in. I use a microphone that has a cord. It's six meters long, but I still, with the camera where it was, it just, I would have been too tethered to it and I didn't want that to be the case. I do have a shotgun mic, but I couldn't find it. And again, it probably would still have a bit of bad quality to the audio when I'm talking. I will try to clean up the audio in the editing software, but it's probably still gonna be a little bit on the bad side, but you know, it doesn't really matter that much. You can still hear what I'm gonna say, what I'm gonna do, and pretty much just watching, you'll understand what I'm gonna do anyway. Now, this planter box is quite short. It's only 500 millimeters high, and the reason for that is I made it for my son and I to be able to make a vegetable garden in, and I wanted it to where he could easily access it um, on top of everything and not have to stand on something or, or anything like that. The beauty about this uh, design is that you can make it as long as you want, as wide as you want, as deep as you want, as tall as you want. I've made a couple of these for a friend in the past and they were actually about double the height. I think the live stream went for about an hour and 20 minutes. Now I have made a couple of these for a friend in the past and they're easily, easily made in under an hour. Uh, but that's about it. So hopefully you enjoy the quick little video of the live stream. And if you want to, you can check out the full length live stream, live stream on my video. What? You can check out the full length live stream on my YouTube channel. And I hope to do some more live streams in the future. Now I think when I was looking, there was like one person maybe watching, but then like no one talked or commented or anything like that so i don't know if that was actually someone watching or not and i still enjoyed it it was fun being able to build something explain what i'm doing without having to worry about getting camera angles and everything and i do want to do some live, more live streams in the future i really like the idea of live streaming one hour builds because a live stream i think should go for about an hour and what better than to build something from start to finish in that hour <laughs> Pieces, the side pieces and the legs done. I'm going to build a box and then I can. No, I'm not. I need to. I need to cut the uh, stretches for the legs on each end so that the uh, floor in the box has something to see. <laughs> I'm going to measure in where the legs are for the final length. That way, if this is bowed at all, it's going to pull it in.
All right, so that concludes the video of making the planter box. As I did say at the beginning, this was taken from uh, my live stream that I did building the planter box, but hopefully you can still get some knowledge out of the video. Now, if you did like the video or if you just wish to be notified or want to see one of my live streams, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, hit the like button on this video, leave a comment, let me know what you think. You can also follow me on social media, on Instagram and Facebook, and I'll have links to those down below as well. And I'll see you next time.